Hey YouTube, what's up? It's DJ Tom Dragon here, slash Tom Dragon 1234. Uh, I'm gonna give you a, a short, simple, easy tutorial on how to monitor your uh, internet data usage if you have like a data cap. Like uh, my internet is, you know, pretty crap. It's a uh, crooked broadband and it has a 8 gigabyte cap, which that is highest the package to go. So that kind of sucks. So if you're using like a hotspot, like Cricket, um, or a hotspot on your phone, and it's connected wirelessly from your phone onto your laptop or whatever, then you might want to monitor it so we don't go over. Okay, now the tool I'll be using in this video is called Free Meter. And right here. And I'll show you how to install that. So open your favorite web browser. Uh, I use Chrome. And then uh, you want to go to the site. Um, M I E C H U dot P L slash Free Meter. And then when you go to there, you go to the link download, the top of the website. And then there should be a small file, very small, a few kilobytes or so. And then there'll be another link to the download free mirror version 1.63, which is the latest one. Then uh, it'll be in a zip file. Then you, what you want to do is just drag it to the desktop. Well, I'm using a, uh, an extraction extraction program called uh, FreeArc, which kind of sucks. But that says my default, I can change it. I like to use WinRAR to extract zip files and raw files and stuff so there should be a button in either one of these programs we are or Lenore or whatever and all you want to do is click extract and then extract it to wherever you want to extract it to desktop is where I would extract my stuff to and then hit ok and then it should be on the desktop there and a zip folder here and that's really it it's pretty much already installed Um, once that folder is on there, that's it, you don't need to extract it anymore. Um, then you click on the folder and you should see the application program, the EXE, and then all you want to do is just create a shortcut to your desktop to send a uh, desktop shortcut there. I already have mine all set. And that's pretty much it. Um, one thing I should mention to you guys is that uh, for zip files, you actually do not really need an extra program. And if you prefer to make it easier, I guess you could. But you don't need anything. Um, you should just be able to just, after you get done downloading, you should just be able to just drag it to your desktop. And if you look the same everything, you don't really need any, any, any extra programs like when you are. Uh, VR or whatever, and that's it. Uh, the only time we need programs is mostly for .dot rar files, like porn and stuff. That's really it. And I'm gonna open it here and show you what it looks like. When you click on the shortcut and open the program, you can double-click it to see the network activity. Download and then the upload. And if you want to see a total, so if you don't like that, if you, if you do not like this graph crap, geeky screen on your desktop, then you can right click it, tools, and then totals log. I'll tell you your total for the day, month, uh, whatever. Go total, 
in a year, so total, then da daily, weekly, monthly, in total, I have that total. And if you want to reset it daily or whatever, you just hit this button, it's not going to. And that's really it. You can set your limits here. Pretty straightforward. Nice little program. The program is exactly um program size is 292 kilobytes is the actual size of the program, so it's fairly small. Okay, and that's pretty much it. Um, also note, um, when you open up the program, it'll be down here in the bottom right corner in your uh, uh, taskbar down here. Uh, you can close this graph. I think you can close it by uh, unchecking the show main window. That's how you get rid of that graph shit. Okay, um. That's basically it. Thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe. Um, I really haven't done a tech video in a while, probably six or so months. Um, I'll start pushing out more tech videos, just small ones or so. And that's really it. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, subscribe, like, and comment, and tell me how I did. Thank you very much. Oh, also, if you need some help, go ahead and comment too. I'll reply as soon as possible.